Hey guys, Dan here. Welcome back to Tomodachi Live, where today, as you can see, I'm in a bit of a different location. I'm actually in Charlotte in North Carolina, which is pretty cool because I'm out on tour in the US. But of course, I had to put some time aside to care for my villagers because... I actually remember to bring my DS this time I went to America. <laughs> so let's dive in. Let's see what's going on. Um, actually, it looks like my DS is still set to my UK times. I'm actually playing at night. Might have to change that because otherwise my Mies are going to be asleep all the time, which would suck. And I think today I'm only going to be able to play through two days, but that's fine. We should have a lot of stuff happening. First up, let's of course check the donations. Let's have a look. Uh, what we got today 219 pounds not too bad still puts us over a thousand but we have been spending a lot recently <laughs> right so let's see what food is about first let's go through buying everything and then we can go back and come back to everything if our mies need something custard slice that looks nice we've got some instant noodles a little bit of ramen going on and some mozzarella salad and just a straight up roast chicken let's buy three of those let's buy some mozzarella salad too Instant noodles. Let's see if anyone likes those. And um, those custard slices are expensive, but let's buy two of them. Right. That's a lot of food that we bought. That could be quite expensive as well. Hats, though. Hats is always my favorite shop. We've got a skull mask. Oh, my goodness. I 100% know who I am giving that to. Give me the skull mask. We've also got some more jaunty cap colors. Didn't we already have those in the previous episode? I think we did. Got some more rabbit hair clips as well that look pretty nice. I like that color. Let me grab one of those of that color as well. I might have another one. Yeah, I've got a pink one too. Okay, that's good. We're, we're fully stuck up on um, rabbit hair clips. Nice. Clothing. We've got a baggy hoodie. That's nice. I like that. Doctor's coat. Okay, there's some really good outfits today. Floral dress, long denim skirt, and a short check dress. Oh, I actually want to buy like three or four of these. I really like the baggy hoodie. It's only £28. I'm going to buy it because we're going to make that back today. Doctor's coat I really like as well. And I also like this, but there's so many colors. I think actually, have we got one of these? I, I swear someone's wearing one of these. I don't know. Let's buy this one anyway and see. Oh, I've, I've spent so much money. Please. Oh, I should have checked the apartments first. I'm in big trouble, guys, today. There's going to be a good one, isn't there? There's going to be such a good interior. There's wedding, which is still there. Football stadium. Yo, that is so cool. Kitchen, which is actually pretty nice. And bohemian as well. I actually like those. Um, I'm going to pick up. Uh, I'm actually not going to pick up any of those. I'm going to see who's missing an apartment first. And then I'm going to buy the appropriate apartment for them. So let's skip out on that for now. Save some money because I'm spending too much. And let's see what our Mies are saying today. We've got another Tomodachi quest. But I have actually completed that now. So I don't really need to do that again. And I found out the reward isn't actually that great. So um, let's head into Minus and see what on earth our Mies have been up to. Magic Up's giving us the news. What's going on, buddy? Crystal, what? Was recovered from a ship that sank off a island called the Jack Fisher. Nice, okay. <laughs> the crystal was probably made in the 17th century. Oh, wow. The crystal expert Dan, who analyzed the find, said, What did I say? It on the ocean floor, protected from sunlight, and so it's really well preserved. <laughs> However, some fish may have had a little nibble, decreasing the value by around six pounds. <laughs> We asked some islanders their opinions. I knew this would happen. Did you, Voldemort? Everyone looks good. I got to get out there too. What? The that doesn't even make sense. Okay, so I found a crystal that has been um, devalued by six pounds. It didn't actually say how much it was worth, but... A crystal that's at the bottom of the ocean from a, an ancient ship sounds pretty expensive. Let's go and see what the Mies are up to today. Grim, are you okay? Grim? Why are you so mad? What's going on? Uh-oh. Oh, hi. Why are you mad? I had a fight with them, are incredible. I'm so mad. Why are you mad? Don't don't be mad, just make up. It's okay. Please help me calm down first. Okay, right, it's time for a bath. I always give them bath sets to calm down because they don't seem to want to do anything else. Actually, the swing helped last time. That was pretty good. Go and take a bath, Grim. He baths, he baths wearing his hat. That's pretty impressive. Right, let's get out of here before it gets too creepy. Now, now go and make up with Mr. Incredible. Jeez. That was so relaxing. He looks good in his towel. He doesn't have any hair, so I guess he doesn't wear a towel on his head. But um, I'm glad you're feeling calmer. Go ahead and make up with him because we can't have people falling out right now. <laughs> I'm sorry about what happened. Oh, I hope he accepts it. I'm sorry too. He did. Oh, what a good sport. Okay, that's good. That's good. Look at his little wiggle dance. 
He's so happy with himself. <laughs> I love it. Okay, so the problem with my DS being so late at night, because it's only like 5 p.m. here in the US, but at home it's 10.53. Uh, everyone is sleeping. Um, let me see. We got a few dreams to take a look at and we still need some dreams to add to our dream collection because we haven't experienced them all yet. But some people definitely are not sleeping. <laughs> Let's see what problems we've got today. I'd like a casual looking hat. But, but, but look at your hat. Your hat looks amazing. You want a casual looking hat. We've got bobble hats. Um, he wants casual though. What is this? A swimming cap. We could do that. That looked pretty good. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to go for the swimming cap. Let's see if he likes it. It's kind of similar to the one he's got now, just less furry, I guess. There we go. Uh-oh. Um, he didn't like that. <laughs> I am gonna give you some food, though. Roast chicken. Brand new. Fresh today. Do you enjoy it, buddy? He did. Okay, that makes up for the swimming cap, I guess. <laughs> and he's leveled up, too. Nice. Hey, I gave him a treadmill, and look, he's using it. <laughs> <laughs> Spider-Man's got to get them gains to, to fight crime and stuff, I guess. Look at him, doing a little power walk, that's so funny. Right, Craig has an issue now, what's up buddy? How's it going? I'd like some new pants. Something stylish would fit the bill. Oh, he wants some new clothes, but his wrestling outfit, oh, it's gonna ruin it. But, um, I guess we don't really have a choice. We've got, um, boys blazer, dinner jacket, trench coat, um... Could do a dress, I guess. I don't think you'd like that, though. Uh, a baggy hoodie, American football uniform, basketball uniform, doctor's coat. We've got loads of costumes as well. You know what? Let's give him the wild pop star because it kind of looks like a wrestling outfit. Just in case. Let's see what it looks like. Fantastic. <laughs> he loves it as well. Okay. Still looks like a wrestler. Still looking beautiful. And he's up to level 10, which is crazy. And he only has two gift spaces left. So we have to be careful what we give him for his last few. Let's give him a scale because he is kind of a wrestler right now. So he needs to keep his weight on point. So I'm going to give him a scale and see what happens. And look, there you go. He's weighing himself, ready for his next match. Look at his outfit. What is he doing? <laughs> <laughs> He's shocked at his weight. It's probably that chicken that I fed him to be honest. Right. Who else has a problem? We've got Misty who's here with Gemma in a ladybug outfit. Let's see what's going on here. It looks like Misty's wearing a, a lab coat already. She needs a new apartment actually, so we should probably go back and buy one. Um, what would you enjoy? Uh, a cave? Okay, so the ones in stock, are they the ones that we've bought before? I don't think it is. I think they might be ones that have just been offered to us before. Floral, we've definitely not bought because that is gross. Where are the good apartments? We've got special as well. We've got cartoon and English garden. Cartoon's quite nice. I'm not sure who I give that to though. And today's items, bohemian and kitchen. She might get on with the bohemian one. You know what? Let's buy that and give it to her for now because it's only 110 pounds. Let's see. See if she likes it. We can also get a tour of this one as well. Okay, that's not too bad. She seems tiny in that room. <laughs> so we have a, a big old chair. We've got some butterflies. We've got some plants. Whatever that is. That looks a bit crazy. A writing desk and a very cool looking door with some big stars as well. Okay, that's pretty good for now. You know what? Anyone with like a basic apartment, we need to change up. So actually, I just read the comments of the previous video while I was out here. And you guys said pretty much the only thing you can do to improve relationships is give out travel tickets. So I am going to try that right now. I don't know how many that I've got. I've got two. So I can use one on Homer and Misty and then one on Smiley and Phil. But for now, yes, she's taken Homer. Okay, so they're going to Japan. Okay, that's pretty cool. Let's see if they get any closer on this one. Tokyo is amazing at night. <laughs> Let's take a photo. Let's take a photo. Look what he's wearing. He's crazy. Right, let's take a photo. You ready? Bam. Oh, you closed your eyes, Homer. What's wrong with you? They do look really cool. Japan is a place I would love to go. Let's take another one. Nice pose, Homer. I like it. He kept his eyes open this time. Look at that pose. <laughs> pose of the year. He could be a model, you know. Right, let's see what's next. Castle is really impressive. It certainly is. Let's take a photo. Let's take another photo. Look at that pose. There we go. Yes, you both closed your eyes, but you know what? That's fine. Let's save the photos. And then let's head out. Let's see if their relationship has improved at all. I'm I'm pretty sure it did when we tried it before. But you guys told me it would happen, so we want to speed up this marriage process. That was amazing. I'm glad you liked it. I got you a souvenir. Oh, nice. What did you get me? A folding fan. Okay, cool. I haven't got that before because it says new. That's nice. Right, so let's check their relationships. 
it actually worked. Okay, um, I did not expect that. That's pretty cool, right? Let's go and check Homer's status if he's not asleep. And we need to move them next to each other as well. Brock's working his part-time job. He's working late. Homer is asleep. Can I enter without waking him up? I just want to check his relationship status. Wants to get married. Okay, it actually works. Right, we are going to check his dream. Hopefully, he's dreaming about getting married. And then we're going to send another travel ticket for Smiley and Phil. Oh, my goodness. That looks pretty creepy. <laughs> Swinging him round. Swinging him round. Kapow! There we go. Right, let's get out of here. That's weird. Okay, so before I forget, let's move them closer together just in case that helps. We want to go from here to here. Switch with Brock. There we go. That works. And then let's check on Phil and Smiley and see if they want to go on a quick old holiday. Smiley's making herself look nice. I like it. What's Phil up to? He's here with Dan TDM rapping away and dancing. I like it. Right. Let's give Smiley the travel ticket and let's see how this works. Very much in love. Okay, this should work, guys. I've only got one more travel ticket, though, and they've been on holiday before, which is probably why they're so far along the marriage train. Let's go. Please take Phil with you. Yes, she took Phil. Okay, they're going to Cambodia. I don't even know where that is. <laughs> Okay, that sounds good. Let's take a photo. I like your hat, Phil. Let's time this properly. Okay, I timed it when they're kind of in. And <laughs> that's an awful photo. Dante's suite is 1,000 years old and so mysterious. Nice. Let's take another one. Okay, I'm going to time this properly this time. There we go. Phil, you got your eyes closed. What's wrong with you? The reflection of Anchor Watt in the background is just perfect. It certainly is. All right, let's take another photo. There we go. Keep your eyes open. That's better. Look at Smiley's face. Let's save those photos. And that could be a pre-honeymoon for getting married. I hope so. I've got two potential marriages coming up. Will they want to get married in their relationship status? I really hope so. Hey, what did you get me? From Cambodia. A Krama headscarf. Nice. So we're getting new treasures for doing this as well. That's awesome. Right, let's check. Completely in love. No, it didn't work as well as before. I think it did change, though. That's pretty good. I often think I should have done things differently. Yeah, you should have got married to Phil. There's actually no problems left today. It's probably because it's so late. I'm definitely going to change my DS time. Otherwise, this is going to happen over and over again. Let's go and check on how Phil is feeling about the whole thing. And I need to give a hat to a special someone today. How you doing, Phil? Wants to get married. Okay, so he's moved up to wants to get married. But Smiley hasn't quite yet. So we need to try and get some more travel tickets out of these me's. I just realized my camera's got super dark. Let me fix that. There we go. Hopefully that's a little bit better. Right, um, so Phil, I'm gonna shake it out of you. Ask her to marry you. Seeing as you're here, let's play. Okay, he wants to play a game. What game are you gonna play, buddy? What's it gonna be? Me facts, okay. I'm usually terrible at these. What's the first Heroes one? and Magical, our friends. Uh, true? The correct answer is. Please be friends. False. No, they're strangers. I lost instantly. I told you I was terrible at this one. Right, let's get out of that pretty quickly. That was embarrassing. <laughs> Thanks for the tissues, buddy. Thank you. Right, Sans, where are you? Oh, he's asleep. Can I wake him up? I can't. All I can do is draw on his face. No. Oh, I can't do anything with him right now. That's super annoying. Okay, so I need to remember tomorrow to give him the skull hat because that's going to be amazing. Oh, someone's at the cafe. Who's at the cafe nice and late? Hello? Oh, <laughs> There you are. Why are you being such a creep? What's going on? Ske Skelebone. Skelebone. Oh, Craig's there as well. I didn't even see that. Why are they being so weird? That's really creepy. Another couple we can check on are Dan TDM and Elsa. Completely in love. So if we had a spare travel ticket, we could send them into marriage mode. Look at them. They're so cute. Oh, he wants to play. Okay, let's play a game. Oh, it's the catch one. What's he going to drop? <laughs> I need this. It's a diamond. Okay, don't play any games. Yes! <laughs> oh, I so wanted that. I don't think I have the diamond yet. We're gonna have to check how much that's worth. There we go. We got the diamond, guys. That's perfect. Right, let's check how much that is worth, and then we can get out of here. Hey, look, Jack Skellington works here. Okay, right, we need the diamond. How much is it? 500 pounds. Okay, that I think that's the most expensive thing we own now. I'm pretty sure. That is amazing. And um, you know what? On that note, I am going to end just for today. So in a couple seconds, I'll head to the next day. Actually, there's someone at the observation tower. <laughs> it's Dan TDM with his new golf clubs. I literally just gave him these. What is he doing? There's no golf ball there. I guess he's just practicing 
for now. My camera's got really dark again. I think it's getting stormy outside. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much all I can do today. I am going to change my DS time so we won't have this problem of everyone being asleep. So don't worry. I am crossing my fingers so much that tomorrow we have a wedding. I don't know if that's going to happen, but at least we can hope. <laughs> so guys, I'll see you in a second. <laughs> Guys, I was going to end the episode there, but I thought, why not try going back in time? So setting from UK time to US time, which is five hours behind, and seeing if the villagers will wake up. And they did. And then my recording software crashed. So I did actually already give Sans the skull hat. He did love it and check it out. He is looking beautiful. He kind of looks like an egg right now, but look at him. <laughs> Sans with the skull hat looks amazing. And look how happy he is. He's so happy with it. I'm glad he is as well because <laughs> it looks so good. So all the food and stuff that we've already explored, including all of the apartments and all of the clothes are exactly the same as they were before because it's still the same day. It's just five hours behind, which means that we can get some extra game time out of today's day, which is actually awesome. Look how many problems there are. Oh my goodness. And PB and, oh no, PB and Zelda are having a fight. I'm in a bit of a bad mood right now. I know, I know. Sort it out though. Please help me calm down first. Would a music box work? Would you mind if I listen to it? No, go ahead. See if it calms you down. There we go. It's her in her own music box. That's kind of weird, but kind of awesome at the same time, I guess. Hopefully it calms her down. I feel common now. I'm going to try to make up. There we go. Much better. There's that intense face again. <laughs> I'm sorry about what happened. I can't forgive you. <gasps> what? That hasn't happened before. I am actually shocked. I am so shocked. What? No, she's got a blue bar. What is wrong with you, Zelda? Are you kidding me? Life is tougher than I expected. Oh, don't be sad. Oh my goodness. I, I'm actually so shocked. That has never happened before. She just straight up shut her down. She was like, no, I'm, I don't forgive you. <laughs> oh my goodness. What can I do to cheer her up? There's not really much here. Um, A swing? Would a swing work? I can't even give her anything, like, or any of my treasures. You know what? Let's see if this works. Come on, you don't need her. Look, you've got french fries. You've got penguins. It's absolutely fine. Just swing your life away. It's absolutely fine. Look at that. <laughs> uh, it feels like floating on air. Okay, does it cheer you up, though? Kind of. Oh my goodness, right. Have we got a favorite food that you like? What's your favorite food? Fish and chips. Oh, I think I just gave my only fish and chips away. Beef boiling yong and English breakfast. I have beef boiling yong. Right, let's see if this cheers her up. A favorite food. Come on. Please. I can't believe that. <laughs> okay, she liked that. Come on, bring yourself out of sadness. So close. What about candy floss? You can't be sad if you got candy floss and I see a little space in your belly for it. Come on, please. Oh, you didn't like it. This is just getting worse. This day is terrible. We couldn't make up. I know. I know. I'm so sad. Oh. Your one looks nothing like this. Oh my goodness. What is that? Yes, it does. Your bear looks nothing like this. <laughs> is that someone? What kind of bear is that? You know nothing about teddies. Okay, so they're fighting over a teddy bear that's actually looking pretty creepy. I mean, Mr. Bear loves me. Oh, I feel so bad. So bad. That's what happens. Oh, man. What am I going to do now? She's got candy floss in her belly, but she's still feeling really sad. I don't know what I can buy her. Maybe a new outfit. I'm going to grab her a new outfit. This is, this is out of order. Actually, I think I already have the perfect one. I've already bought one of these. Let's see if she likes that. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Okay, you have to like this. If you don't like this, I've done a terrible job at cheering you up. Come on. It's going to suit you. Look at that. Yes. Okay, this should bring her out of sadness. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Phew. That was intense. I think I'm getting over it now. Good. That was bad. That was really bad. And I got a reward as well. Please be a travel ticket. Please. Okay, we got a dramatic instead. I'm glad you're feeling better. You got a full stomach. And you got a nice boyfriend. Let's get out of here. Zelda, where are you? I am super upset with you. Really upset. I can't believe you did that. Right, Elsa, what's going on? What can I say when I am angry? Oh, I don't know. Um, okay. Actually, I've got I've got the perfect thing. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> don't let it go. <laughs> oh, that's so punny. I'm so worried about where Dunty DM could be right now. Oh, I don't actually know. Um, you're in love. That's good. Wait. Did the relationships change? I hope not. Okay. 
Woo, we're good. We're good. It's, it's absolutely fine. Don't worry. <laughs> I was worried then. Wow, look. There's like a focus group going on here. Look at Brock's face. <laughs> Would you like to see a weird face that I've been practicing? Yes, of course. Take it away, buddy. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> How'd you move your eyes like that? I'm happy you liked it. Good, I'm glad. I really need to be nice to my me's. Not that I'm not all the time, but I really need the travel tickets now. And look, we've got another clear set of oh okay taylor's messed that up she's asleep though how can she have a problem maybe she's hungry i like your apartment taylor it's very nice what's your problem i want to take a bath uh okay you know what i have three bath sets ready go ahead and take a bath there we go <laughs> a preview of taylor's new smash hit Right there, I like that. Right, what are you going to give me in return? You're going to give me Kidomatic. I've got loads of these adult and Kidomatic things. It's so weird, right? You need some food as well. Eat a cheeseburger. What's better after a bath than a cheeseburger, guys? And there you go. Now it is a perfectly clear slate for the second time today. Do we have any other events happening? Uh, I don't think there's anything happening here. Can we get collect donations again? No. That would have been a pretty good. But there you go. We kind of got two days in one there and um, a really big argument happened, which I'm a little bit worried about and angry with Zelda about because that was really, really unfair. But um, we also got some extra money, which is pretty good because our Mies weren't asleep. Look at Mr. Incredible Dance. I love it. So um, guys, we kind of got two days in one there. So I'm going to skip straight to tomorrow. And um, yeah, let's carry on our journey. <laughs> Here we go guys, day two. So let's check in. I don't know what we're gonna do first. Looks like there's a lot of friendships to be made today, which is actually pretty cool. But first off, of course, we need to collect our donations. Um, oh, okay, uh, who's this? <laughs> Who is that? I can't even see, is it Treorus? It is Treorus, I have no idea what he's doing. You're so strange, so I guess it hasn't been long enough to collect donations again since I played yesterday. Hmm, that's a little bit weird, and I don't think the hats and stuff have changed either. They haven't. Okay, so that's probably messed it up for a little bit, so we've not got any new items today, but we do have some new stuff going on in here. So at least that is happening, but um, Finn and Mr. Incredible are having a fight. Now, um, last time, the fight didn't resolve very well, so um, you know what? Let's see how this one goes, shall we? He's still really mad. What, why? Can I rub your face? I don't know what to do. Hey, look. It's actually working. <laughs> I didn't know you could pet them. What? That's so weird. I did not know you could pet them. He seemed to like that. Okay. What? <laughs> what? Why do you get money for, <laughs> for petting them on the head? Oh, okay. That's really weird. <laughs> <laughs> fine, take a bath. It's absolutely fine. Just go, go take a bath. You're always so annoyed. There we go. <laughs> That's the same face he made when I just rubbed him on the forehead. Right, there you go. You're in your towel. Go and make up with Mr. Incredible. Jeez. I'm sorry about what happened. But will they make up? Please. Please. I'm sorry too. Okay. Phew. <laughs> that could have gone badly. Right, there's a lot of games going on. Oh, look, he's playing with his dog. That's really cute. What is that dog doing? He's destroying that ball. He's not even stopping. That's so weird. Right, who else has a problem? Anna, she's with her cat. We need to give Anna some kind of uh, apartment. I can't believe we haven't given her one yet. I want a cool hat. A cool hat. You've already got a cool hat, right? What's What could possibly be cooler? I could give you another kind of snow-themed hat, but um, what else have we got? Got a, a conical hat, I guess. How about... The Phantom Mask. I don't know if you're gonna like this. I've only got the black one. It might look really odd, but let's see what happens. I thought I had a white one, but I don't. Oh! Oh no, she doesn't like that. <laughs> that looks terrible as well. What have I done to you? Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay, so Gemma is angry at someone. Voldemort is angry at someone. Oh my goodness, why are, why are you guys all so angry? What's going on? I had a fight with Voldemort. Ah, I'm so mad. That makes sense. <laughs> okay, you make up, guys. Please help me calm down first. Everyone's having arguments. Why? Uh, let me see. Oh, she wants to get married to Skeleton. Oh, geez. Okay, Um, let me see if I can give them a disposable camera. Let's see if I, that helps their relationship, because I'm pretty sure... Oh, 
She doesn't want to do it. Okay, that's fine. Music box. Okay, I know this helps people calm down. We've got eight of them. Okay, let's use that. Listen to it. Be fine. There's so many me's that have the potential to get married. Oh, I'm so excited. Wait, what is that? Is that a photography studio? I thought it always had their me on it. Oh, that's so weird. I'm sorry about what happened. Come on, please be nice. Please be nice. I'm sorry too. Okay, we're good. They're not getting all upset all over the place. At least we're only having to deal with one upset me. They're going to do the wiggle dance, and they're feeling better. That's good. Right, so since Gemma wants to get married, let's go and check on Skelebone and see if he wants to get married as well. If so, that's going to be pretty cool. And then I'll try the camera and see if that helps. Yeah, he wants to get married as well. How how is this? How long is this going to take? Let's see if the camera helps their... Um, oh, I've already given him one before. Let's go to Gemma and give her one because she hasn't used one yet. Okay, that's three couples. So that's Gemma and Skeleton. Uh, Phil and Smiley and Homer and Misty, I think they want to get married too. Right, let's give you the camera and see if you guys go on an adventure to get the best pictures. I would like you to take an Islanders photo. Got it. I'm going to get snapping. Okay, cool. Take a very flattering photo of Skelebone. Oh my goodness, what is going on here? We've got Two-Faced Minion, Brock, Sands with his amazing skull hat, and Spongebob. All fighting. In a love heart room. I mean, what is going on here? Let's save that. <laughs> That's pretty cool, actually. I like that a lot. <laughs> I'm going to give that a big 10 out of 10. I like it. Yeah, I knew I had an eye for it. Exactly. I feel like eating some bread. Um, okay. I think I've got some bread. We've got... We've got some somewhere, I'm sure. White bread. Okay, let's just give you some plain white bread. That's not going to be very nice to eat, though. Or is it? Okay, it is. <laughs> oh, man, he's so weird. It's on his, like, number two on his likes. Just plain white bread. Magic up. Did you just toot? He definitely just tooted, didn't he? Did you hear that? <laughs> oh, my goodness. We need that for Treorus. That would be amazing. Look at that. That would be so good on Treorus. Right, what did I get? I'm going to go middle and see what we have won. What is that? Some beads. Oh, there was a TV. A TV on the right-hand side? I don't think I have a TV yet. Oh, man. Oh, you have a problem now. What's up? What should I say when I feel down? Why is everyone so angry today? Here we go. What do I tell her to say? I let it go. <laughs> I think that's the second phrase that we've taught her today. I'm pretty sure. And we're making lots of money from solving all these problems. Whoa, that would also look amazing on Treoris. Look at that. I need all these wigs. Why don't I get this stuff? Hey, there we go. The headwear quizzes are cool because I kind of get a preview of what I can unlock later down the line. Let's go small because I haven't actually chosen that yet. What is that? A scented candle. Oh, that's, is that nunchucks? Or is that a skipping rope? I'm not too sure, but I got the candle. That's new. That's cool. And I'm running out of food. Look, I've only got three dishes left. Fake Dan TDM has a problem, but he's asleep. That's a little bit weird. Let's see what's going on. He's got a dream as well. Let's see what that is about. What are you dreaming about, buddy? Oh, this might be a new one. I think this is a new one. Oh my goodness. <laughs> What? Don't fall in. Oh, I thought he was going to fall in. What was that? Four giant heads? I got myself a rubber ring. That's actually pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot. <laughs> hey, look. Fake Dan, TDM, and Phil are plotting something evil on their laptops. <laughs> both tapping away. They're both tapping away or they're playing Minecraft. Whichever one. And there you go. Another clean slate for today. So I think I'm going to add... Oh my goodness, there's so many events going on. There's a photo shoot, Tomodachi quest, of course. A chat session. Okay, let's have a look. There's a group of girls chatting about something. Let's find out what's going on, shall we? Hello? <laughs> I'm so into abacuses recently that I can't get any sleep. <laughs> I want one now, too. Oh man, abacuses. The shops still have stock. Doesn't Spider-Man look so sophisticated? <laughs> They're having a proper gossip. So refined. Wow, Spider-Man yeah. is popular. They're eating cake and drinking tea. You know, I was thinking about changing my hairstyle. <laughs> you should stay as you are. Aww. Don't do it. They're being so nice. I heard that drinking bacon extract is really good for you. What? Really? <laughs> no way. <laughs> Bacon extract. Brock is really talented, isn't he? Oh, they're actually being nice about everyone. Absolutely. <laughs> so skillful. <laughs> they're probably talking about his magic acts, I would have thought. Hey, did you hear the gossip about Magicka? Oh, what was the gossip? What's that? What was it? 
I don't know. Oh, wow. Um, that was great, guys. Right, I'm backing out. <laughs> that was cool, though. So, guys, I've just been editing today's Tomodachi Live right here, and it turns out we actually have 30 minutes of footage already. As you can see, I'm editing in my dressing room right now. I'm wearing a microphone for rehearsals. <laughs> so, because we time-traveled, we actually did kind of fit three days in, and I didn't realize we had so much stuff that happened, including that crazy argument. So, um, I'm going to cut the episode today. You have to look forward to new items and stuff in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, a big fat thumbs up would be great. Subscribe if you are new to join Team. TDM today and I will see you guys later. Bye!